slow guys uh, right now uh, this is gonna be a, the intro for the video that I just uh, that y'all are gonna see I forgot to uh, what's it called do an intro but this is my Peter bow right here I'm holding some scrap metal right now at the uh, in the rest of the video I, I have some uh, aluminum logs uh, when y'all saw me in my last video I was a driver uh, working in the belly dumps the dirt work but uh, uh, I got my own truck uh, because, uh, and our own work our own authority with my dad and uh, I just truck right there and yeah uh, not too fancy but I mean it's a work truck you know Someday I'll be able to have a 379 or 389 extended hood. Uh, not like in the last video. But um, yeah. That's it. Hope y'all enjoy the rest of the video. I want to make sure this is recording. Yeah, okay. We're good to go. To record. Alright. So now I've got blue with blue. Green with green, which is your electric pool, and then this is blue but it was red. I just changed it because uh, one of these days it was it, it got super cold and the one I used to have The so one I used to have, uh, what's it called? It cracked, cause it was super cold. And I had this one as an emergency. So it's always good to have one spare. And I just got that new air back right here. It was leaking some air. So we're gonna go. So we need to do six. One, two, three. Four, five, six, yeah. Pretty good. Yeah, it just uh, started pouring today morning. And it got to the point that I was like really, really bad. All right. driver right there Back over there, the purple truck, purple maroon. 
I guess, uh, I don't even know what to talk about. Um, last time when I was working at the, at the belly dog, I was just a driver, right? Like I said, um, I was just a driver. I worked there for like, uh, like six months or something. Before that, well, my, okay, my first job was, uh, at, uh, Andrews, which was, uh, which was a beer distributing place. That was my first job. That was like probably like a week, like a week, no, two weeks, a week or two weeks after I had just graduated high school. So I was basically, I guess, fresh, fresh out of high school. And uh, I was a uh, when I was in high school, I actually had my my CDL permit already. I just didn't have my my actual CDL. And then a week after I graduated, I got my CDL, and then I I applied to a uh, to Andrews and they hired me immediately because they were they were hiring and so uh, that was a that was a pretty fun job it was uh, basically delivering beer to to gas stations groceries um, C stores all that stuff and uh, basically you had to uh, you had to uh, let's go Unload your truck with a with a pallet jack, and then break down the beer, make some, uh, put in an order. Uh, like example, uh, Modelo go with Modelo, Corona go with Corona, and stuff like that. And obviously, uh, fill uh fill in the coolers, rotate the beer, restock the coolers, and all that stuff. Uh. Well, what else? Uh, print out invoices for the for the for the owners of the store, and uh, go with, go check the check the order with them. If everything was correct, then they gave you the check and on to your next store. You know, that was my first job, and then I did a little bit of container jobs too. Uh, I think that was my my actual first video. Uh, that I have on my YouTube channel. Uh, I was doing containers, picking them up. They had GM parts, like the car, the General Motors. They had uh, parts. I'm not sure what type of parts, but it, that's what it had. And I delivered them to uh, this place called Universal. And then from there, they took it to the actual plant because the plant was really strict. From there, uh, it was a, uh, it was all right. That job was just that. The equipment, it just, it was trash. So, uh, I liked the, the I, I got along with the owner and everything. He was cool, but, and, uh, I don't know. I just, I just didn't really feel it like that. Then, I met a guy, he, uh, that I, I met a guy, he wanted me to drive for him. I was driving Amazon with him. I had a really nice, I had like a 2014 Canworth uh, T680. It was automatic. So that was cool. So in the Andrews, it was automatic containers. I was a uh, 10-speed manual. Then uh, Amazon, uh, Amazon uh, it was for a, a contractor. It was uh, automatic. So driving automatic, I mean, it's, manual is more fun, but then automatic, it, it's always, uh, I guess it's easier when you're in traffic. You know, you don't have to go one, two, one, two, one, two, three, you know? But uh, it has its ups and downs, both of them. And then I did that for like a couple months. And then Amazon, what the thing about Amazon is that Amazon is really, uh, it's more like a, how do I say, it? like a temporary job. As in like, when, that, when, when that's good to haul for, it's like before the holidays or in between the holidays. Cause you know, everybody's ordering stuff online for Christmas or whatever, New Year's. Uh, that's when it's good to work for them but as in just working working with them uh, I'm, not, I'm not too sure about that at least what, what I know from and also they're really strict with their time if you get there late once probably uh, they they they, uh, they block you from getting some of their loads this is my dad oh he's all the way back there yeah they block you from getting some loads and uh, I don't know. It was, it, it was probably one of the easiest jobs I've done for sure though. Because everything was on the phone on Amazon Relay. Uh, you had to deal with no paperwork. Everything was on the phone. Pick up, hook up. 
go where you have to drop it off and that's it. Literally super easy. Um and then after that I went to the belly dogs, I got I learned the more on the third side, Holly Dirt, Holly Sand, Gravel, uh, uh Flex Base, all that stuff, asphalt. Um that was a pretty it was a pretty cool job too. Only thing, the only downside about that job is that, uh, or just that, uh, what, how do I say it? Uh, not just that job, but everything that has to do with the third job, that it, when it rains, you don't work. When it rains, you don't, uh, damn, this guy is full all the way to the top, and he doesn't have a tarp. Um, yeah, 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 so what I was saying is, uh, that's the only downside, that's like a good, it's a good summer job, that's how I should say it. Whenever, whenever it's really hot, you start working, and if it rains one day, uh, since it's so hot, it just dries, the dirt dries off, dries off, the mud dries off, and you can start working the next day, you know, but like around this time right now, with, with, between, uh, what is it, uh, between November and probably like, February and March. It's not really like a good time to work because it's cold, it rains, it takes forever to dry up and you know. And so with that we're getting unloaded right now. We're getting unloaded. Uh so what this is is basically uh aluminum logs. I believe that's what you call them. Aluminum logs and um, hold up, I can see that. Aluminum logs and uh, so where we pick them up, that's where they make them, and then where we take them is where they basically melt it down so they can make stuff for like uh, parts for houses, uh, parts for for cars. To, uh, they make trailers off of that. Every, everything that has to do with aluminum, you know? We're getting unloaded and uh, yeah, I took my little Peterboat. Not, not the fastest or uh, or the best looking one, but I mean, it's a work trick, you know what I mean? Can't complain about that. And it's working as close to. Sir, 